With the amount of tech that surrounds us nowadays, everything from smart wearables, refrigerators, heck, even our vehicles is jam-packed nowadays with a ton of tech. Everything is gaining this much love except for our wallets. But this all changed now. This right here is Extra Parliament Wallet, which you can actually add some smart features like locate your wallet. It not only plays a ringtone, but it will also show you your last known location when your wallet was last connected to your smartphone. Now the color that you're looking at is the Juniper Green, and this wallet is available in seven different color options to choose from as well. So if you're not a big fan of this green, you could also pick the traditional black or brown leather option. Now Extra themselves did actually went ahead and send us this wallet for us to review. And before I even review a product, I make sure I daily it first to test out how well it does on day to day use. And if it doesn't fall apart from wear and tear. And so far, I had this wallet for about one month now, and the premium European leather that this wallet is made from is holding up really well. Now in total, this wallet is listed to be able to hold up to 10 cards, but only six of these or five of these are gonna be RFID protected, as only very few of them could actually fit inside the aluminum casting. And down underneath here, it's a little lever you could pull that will release all the cards. Now. They said you could fit up to 6 cards inside this little slot, but from my experience, I can only get up to 5. This is due to the fact that all my credit cards have the 3D bold number writing, which those are taking up a lot of space. And for those wondering, you could actually leave 1 or even 2 cards on this thing, and they're gonna stay inside a little card slot. They don't fall out as easy, and when you hit the little lever to pull them out, it still releases just fine. Then on the flap itself, you could have another 2 cards. And you can put two more cards on the back here, but since this wallet has the tracker, this little tracker takes a space up to two cards. Now the tracker itself isn't included with the wallet, as this part's actually sold separately, but I believe you can actually bundle this up on their website. But on Amazon so far, I only see these two sold separately. And this little card retails for around $50. And without the tracker, it's basically just your standard wallet. So the features that you get with the tracker is quite a few, surprisingly. When you first pair it up, it's really easy. It's as easy as just simply downloading the third-party companion app, and the app itself will pretty much pair it up for you. In the application, you not only can have access to find its last known location it was last connected, but you can also allow the application to ring your wallet in case you lose it. And if this ringtone is annoying, you can also change it with another one that's already pre-made on the application. And you can upload it to the little tracker. This tracker does support smart home assistants like Alexa, Google, even Siri. And on your smartphone, you can actually create a shortcut. So you could quickly ask Siri right off your phone or Apple Watch even to ring it just in case you lost it somewhere in a house. And similar to like Tile, and if you were to accidentally lose the wallet, if you mark down your wallet as lost, that person with the same app could also walk by and pick up your wallet, scan the QR code, and they will be able to get your contact information to get a hold of you to return your wallet. So they basically thought about everything with this tracker. And no, there's no monthly service fee to have all these features. Now the tracker itself is rechargeable with a solar panel. So if you allow this thing to charge for at least 3 hours, they say you could get up to a month worth of charge out of this thing. And if you look back here, there's also a button you could press. So if you double tap it, it will actually ring your phone. So if you lose your wallet, you can find it with your phone. And if you lose your phone, you can find it with your wallet. And if you're the person that likes to carry cash around, you can actually hold some cash right here on this little strap. But depending how much cash you like carrying around, it's going to add a lot of bulk to your wallet. And with this flap, this is the only thing I don't like about this wallet. This little flap doesn't seal or stay shut automatically. So if you carry a lot of cards, this will start opening up a lot. And may, as you may imagine, become annoying. But if you travel light, I haven't even faced any issues when it comes to placing this in and out of my pockets. But I would have personally liked if this part was actually removable somehow. So my overall thoughts with this wallet, it's luxurious. I like the little logo that they stamp right here, and it's really slim in some ways. It's not very large or bulky, but can become very bulky if you put a lot of cards or cash onto this. So this Esker wallet retails for about $80 on Amazon, and the tracking chip itself will run you another $50. But if you plan on getting both of them, 
it's best just to go to their website because I just checked they do bundle those two up for a discount but if you just want the tracker and just add it to your current wallet you can also do so so if you need that extra space because you might carry a lot of cards or cash with you going with the tracker itself it's not a bad choice so if you're looking for a luxurious wallet that can be integrated with a lot of tech and works extremely well and is slick and somewhat low profile I would definitely recommend checking out some of Xdirt's uh, wallets. But anyway folks, that's going to be it for this video. If you guys enjoyed this product review video, you know what to do. Leave this video a like and feel free to comment down below if there's another wallet you have in mind that you want to compare against this one. I'm always up for new ideas to do some fun comparison, but that's going to be it for this video. Again, if you enjoyed, like, share, subscribe, and I'll catch you all in the next one. Peace!